So let's just continue working on the, the greebles here. I'm going to, what I'm going to do is kind of etch out a panel here. And then I'm going to put some pipes just going through there and coming out everywhere, I would say. So we can do this. We'll do this. We've used the spin tool before, but let's have about we now try the Bezier tool. So we're going to do control R. I'm going to put it about there. Control B. I want to select the bottom faces. So I'm going to these four. That's not the center. That is the center. Extrude on the Z size Z zero. Okay. So now we've kind of, we've got this hole. Let's put in the bevel on the angle. Just a smidgen and smooth. All right. So first things first, cursor to center, shift a, let's add in a busy air curve. So these are wonderful curves. So this is for, you know, we can do really complex, whoops, rotate Z 45 minus, and now we've got lines. So this is where we can make some intricate uh, wires on the Y 90. Okay. Oh, geez. Alt H. So I'm just going to be moving these into a position. G rotates. And this is pretty much exactly the same as the mesh tool as well. So let's just fix these handles up. So I'm going to scale this. I'm going to scale this one as well. And now I can go extrude to add in kind of like a new curve. Mm. Oh yeah. And I'm going to move this all over. And where should this go? This, I know where it can go. It can go that way. Whoops, don't need it across, across the ship. So, shift D, whoops, extrude, ah. Uh, okay, let's just line that all back up. And what we'll do, is so I'm going to create another greeble block in there. All right. Let's now go into the curve tool editor. We want to fill it full. Now the rend the resolution here is of how many kind of see these arrows. It's kind of like a subsurf type thing. Twisting, we want to keep to a minimum. Um, geometry. So a bevel is the depth of how thick we want the cable to be. So we can have a super cable. I reckon that's thick enough. So the resolution is set to zero, which is four. So we can see that we've got four edges. So it looks like a square. Um, so if you look at this bit and as we increase the resolution, it just becomes more and more of a pipe. Yeah, that seems pretty good. Um, so I'm just thinking technically if you replace the engine, first you've got to uncouple all the cables anyway. Hmm. I reckon though it needs to have a little bit more. <coughs> uh, like where's it going? So I think, I think what we're going to do is come on. So we are going to create a kind of bar that the cable goes through to kind of keep the cable steady. Um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to select all shift D and I'm going to duplicate it. 
so this is my cable G and it's just going to go kind of in there as well alright so let's work out which one's which yep I believe I think we can shorten these bring these ones up so it kind of it's closer to the ship let's oops G on these ones gonna rotate and we'll scale that and so as you can see we're very quickly creating just really nice greebles out of nothing um, I'm going to select all these. Shift D will do one more. Deselect. G. Let's put that one in there. And put that one in there. And so because we've got this part here, let's. Is that going through there? Nope. So I'm going to change it up a little bit, just so it's a little less uniform. Let's add in a Shift S cursor to the center, so we'll put that in the center. Shift A, a mesh, a cube. Come on, let's go and create that kind of block that's going to hold these together. Or plate, might I say. right in there okay so that looks quite nice what can we do here so if I extrude on the Z scale on the X extrude on the Z Okay, and I think I might just go Shift D, move that on the Y. And let's see if I can plop that in like so. And then that means I'll raise this one up, this one up, just so they kind of have a bit of a unison in there. Now, we can also mirror modify them. Let's mirror modifier these and a bevel. Bevel's a little bit too thick. Angle. A bit too much still. And so straight away, we've got this. Now right, let's do and we'll work on this hole in the next section.